What is going on, you guys? My name is Jess, and welcome to Original Ink by Jess. In this video, we'll be customizing these basketball shoes. So let's get started. All right, you guys, we'll be customizing these Paul George 4 basketball shoes with the colors being white, navy blue, red, and I'm super excited to be customizing these. So let's get into the design for them. So this is my sketch. Um, the sketch is based off of African prints and then also the Black Lives Matter movement. I wanted to do a play off of the USA with black culture. So we're getting into the part of taping the shoes. This is absolutely my least favorite part to do, but I know it's very important. So we make sure that no paint gets on the soles or any parts of the shoe that is not intended for paint. So I really like to take my time in taping up the shoes properly so after I'm doing my final touches, I'm not really having to work that hard on getting XX paint off of stuff that wasn't supposed to have paint in the first place. Also, what you guys will see is I'm not painting up the whole shoe because I'm only going to be doing black paint on the white part of the shoe. And I just wanted to save time so I didn't have to tape up the rest of the shoe. And so we are just using an X-Acto knife to cut off the excess and that's how I'm able to get real close to the edge and not get any on the paint, the part that I am going to be painting. Ta-da! All done. I think I did a really great job at taping up these shoes and now let's get into prepping the paint. For this paint job I will be using black paint, too soft additive for the paint, and then just mixing it in in my jar. So let's get to it. So the ratio for paint and too soft is half and half I believe. Um, I'm still getting used to adding the additive to the paint, so don't take my word for it and make sure you read the instructions. But I think it worked out really well for this design after I was completely done with it, which you'll see at the end of this video. Um, the whole point of Too Soft is basically to just keep the fabric soft and to not let it get stiff which will prevent cracking of the paint when the person is wearing the shoes. Ryan Little. <laughs> It's time for my favorite part the painting so right now as you can see I'm just doing what makes me feel good and I also am using a toothpick actually to go in the holes so these shoes were really hard to customize because it was a mesh fabric so the when I was painting with just a paintbrush I could still see white within the black so what I had to do is use a toothpick to get into the little holes of the fabric so it looks complete 
um, which was very interesting. Um, I didn't think it was going to work, but it actually did, and it definitely elevated my design to look complete. Um, I was just really freehanding this, and whatever came to me, I just did it. Um, I didn't want the shoes to be exactly the same because um, I know I would have to really be diligent on where I place things and I just wanted to just have it be free. All right, that was a quick paint session. It took me probably, I want to say two hours to do both shoes. And now we're removing the tape so we can do the final reveal. Um, I was really proud of myself to finally do these shoes. My brother <laughs> sent these shoes to me over a year ago and I just haven't had the courage to actually execute this design. Um, but now that I have, I'm really glad that I did and I hope you guys really like it. So let's get into the final reveal. Dun dun dun! This is the final reveal. I hope you guys all like it. So as you can see on the right shoe, it says justice. And then on the left shoe, it says equality. Because I think those are the two words that the Black Lives Matter movement really implement and also are really striving for and is part of their mission. And I just didn't want to overshadow the colors that were already on the shoes. So I wanted to keep it real simple with just adding black to it. So I really think that it does complement the shoe. I will definitely tell my brother, do never <laughs> send me shoes like this again. Because I do feel like these shoes aren't meant to be customized. But I think I did a good job. Alright you guys, that's it for this video. Thank you guys all for watching. And always remember, be you, stay true, be Original Ink. I'll see you guys in the next video.